In the past 20 or 30 years, we have seen the emergence of a lot of new tools in the field of architectural design and in the field of construction. What we do is to materialize this digital architecture into a real construction. Working in an environment that is both physical and digital, we are able to work towards solutions that are much more customized than building in the same way. 3D printing is a technique that enables to build faster, it's more efficient, it's automated. Of course, we are interested in these qualities, but as architects, we are able to have a larger amount of flexibility in design, meaning that your house can be different from my house, and we can create architectural solutions that are adapted to the context in which we are. In design, tools such as robots and 3D printers create new opportunities and also new limits on what we can do in architecture. Today they're still a bit expensive, but surely they're becoming more and more affordable and we're still exploring them. It's a new things where we believe there's still a lot to learn. We have to work a lot to get into the legal barriers and we have to be confident with the technology so that we can deliver buildings that last for decades. We have a problem of sustainability in construction, but we also have inefficient buildings that use a lot of energy to keep the heat or the cold inside our building. And suddenly, using all this technology is a very good occasion to rethink the way we do architecture, looking now what is our impact, not only on the budget, but also get integrated better in our nature, in our environment. Tova is a small piece of architecture that was constructed by using 3D printing and earth. In the natural park of the Colcerrola, we have used the earth directly from the ground, we have mixed it with natural fibers, and we have passed it through our 3D printers in order to construct this small 4x4 structure, which is aging very well. This was for us a demonstration that we could be much more sustainable than the current construction industry, yet deliver quality architecture, where it feels very good to be inside and a very interesting space to live in. It feels homey to be in this kind of building, and especially when you look at very extreme climate change, you end up in this building with a very well-regulated space. Earth is a material that you can easily recycle, fix and adapt, so it's really easy to demolish a wall, recycle this earth and make another wall somewhere else in your building. We don't believe that 3D printing is going to replace any of the existing techniques. No? We believe in the hybridization of techniques and of materials. Probably there's not one technology fit all and probably not 3D printing for everything, but us 3D printing have a huge role to play, especially in the housing market. We believe that within a not too distant future, we will all be living in buildings that are, if not completely 3D printed, partially 3D printed.